Now, off air, you were talking to me about uh, an investor that you, you you were just dealing with not too long ago in terms of uh, uh, when they refinanced, they were able to refinance and pull out more money. How does that whole process work for some of our guys that have never done that before? Yeah, it's something that um, call, we call flip to yourself. Okay, I uh, love that term. Key flip yeah. to yourself. I, mean, yeah. I, I learned this really early on, and when I was working with my editor writing my first book, um, we came up with this idea together. I love naming things. Okay. Right? Like a flip to yourself. Yeah. There's this uh, way that we can find... Four ways to win. Four ways to win. Yeah. We've got the income analyzer. Yeah. That's how we figure out income. I my editor and I told my, my editor, I said, look, I, I love this concept where I don't want to flip to other people. Okay. And my editor was a flipper. Uh, <laughs> he was uh, a flipper. I said, well, why? Right? Everyone likes to flip because yeah. that's what the shows say. Yeah. Buy and hold, flip flip Lauren, that. buy and hold. So, you know, I will caveat it with you yeah. do have to flip to raise money. Right. And hold, right? Yes. That's your ultimate goal. Yes. Right? So you might, fl you might flip three, hold one. Flip yes. three, hold one. Everyone okay. has a different ratio based yep. on their, their uh, pro forma. But, but anyway, flipping. Yeah. So here's what you do. Is okay. You spend all of this time and effort up front. You qualify for financing and get financing, which is really difficult. Doesn't right. matter how much money you have or what your income looks like. It's it's hard work. It's it's a pain in the butt. And then you do a renovation, which anyone who's done a renovation knows that that is not easy either. Right. It's a pain in the butt. You, and all the other steps in between, fill it with tenants, qualify them, get them all in there. You do all this hard work, and you mean to tell me you're going to sell the property? You've done all of the hard work. All now the keep sweat it for equities. Years. Yeah. Keep it forever because the rest of it is just ongoing maintenance. It's the little stuff. So that's what I learned about flipping is that I'm doing all the work because I did, did a number of flips in the first few years. Okay. I did all this work. I gave it to somebody and then I would drive by the property six months later. I'm like, this new landlord is making all this rental income that I should be making. So that was your aha moment. You did all the work. So after that, I said, I'm not going to flip it to somebody else anymore. And I just said it. I'm like, I'm going to flip it to myself. <laughs> And 16 years later, 15 years later, we still use that term. Still I'm use that term. To myself. I love it. This means I'm going to buy it. Right. I'm going to add value. Yes. And instead of giving that to somebody else, I'm going to just flip that value to myself. And that often means refinancing. So right. I refinance at the higher amount, which yes. is what you were saying. I take out the money at new 80% loan to value. Sometimes you get all the money you put in tax free because you're not uh, selling it. There, it doesn't trigger any disposition. Right. Um, you get the cash and you have the rental income forever. And now with that cash, you can go to Vegas and spend it. Yeah. Obviously, that's probably not the smart thing to do. Go, you can go buy more. And yeah. now you're essentially coining what you said at the start, using other people's money. Using other people's money. Right. Uh, and you know, I even say, look at it this way. I say, uh, people ask me, how'd you get the down payments for the first 15 properties? Yes. I say, easy. It was one down payment. I used it 15 times. That's awesome. I just flipped to myself. I'd take it and be like, let's buy another property. Right. Now, I did a lot of the work myself. Uh, got in there, learned how to hang drywall, learned how to do all those things. Right. So that saved some of the costs. So yes. I buy is a down payment every time. Yeah. Uh, but yeah.